42 part a y equal x plus 1 square x minus 1 uh, to find roots y equal 0 x plus 1 square x minus 1 equal 0 x plus 1 uh, equal 0 or x plus 1 equal 0 or x minus 1 equal 0 x equal minus 1 no x equal minus 1 no x equal 1 so both are same so x equal minus 1 no x equal 1 now when uh, x equal 0 then y equal 0 plus 1 square 0 minus 1 which is minus 1 so the curve causes the y axis at 0 minus 1 then uh, we can see that this is the coefficient is positive so we can have a, a kind of a guess that uh, then uh, that x goes to positive infinity y also go to positive infinity x go go to negative infinity then y also go to negative infinity because the coefficient of uh, x cube is going to be positive in general it is right i discussed previously the standard format is something like this and if those two roots become together then um, uh, you may see that uh, this kind of actually this is the shape so you have to fix this shape accordingly that's all basically you have to adjust now we'll draw the this is x this is y and uh, zero minus one and this this root is one zero and this is the repeated root minus one zero and x goes to infinity y also goes to infinity it means the curve goes to this direction x is increasing y also increasing so curve goes to this direction to find roots we have to make y equal to 0 this is part b then uh, x plus 2 x minus 1 x minus 1 equal 0 i wrote this one two times so x plus 2 equal 0 or x minus 1 is equal 0 or x minus 1 equal 0 x equal minus 2 or x equal 1 or x equal 1 so we have two repeated root x equal 2 or x equal 1 and uh, when uh, x equal 0 y equal 0 plus 2 0 minus 1 square which is 2 so that point is 0 2 so it will cut y axis at uh, y axis at uh, 0 2 now all the x 
coefficient of x cube is positive so we are expecting in general uh, x goes to positive infinity y goes to positive and x goes to negative infinity um, uh, negative infinity y also goes to negative infinity now let's uh, draw the curve it is going from 0 to 2 somewhere and this is going to be the repeated root and and this is starting from somewhere and in somewhere so basically y and x uh, this is um, 0 2 So we'll draw a general version of this one. So I took the peak off, not exactly there. And this is minus two zero, and this is one zero. And yeah, that's all basically. find roots we will make y equal 0 then uh, 2 minus uh, x x plus 1 square equal 0 2 minus x equal 0 or x plus 1 equal 0 x equal 2 or x equal minus 1 so we have two repeated roots that is minus one then uh, when x equals zero y equal two and one square which is two so it will cut y axis at uh, zero two and now we can see that the coefficient of uh, x cube is negative. In general, x goes to positive infinity, uh, y goes to negative infinity, and x goes to negative infinity y goes to positive infinity now it's going from here so now the uh, we have so it, it's going to be uh, this kind of one now so you have to adjust this shape accordingly So this is one point repeated root minus one zero and uh, this is two zero and this is zero two to find roots We want to make y equal 0, then x minus 2 times x plus 1 square equal 0, x minus 2 equal 0, or x plus 1 equal uh, 0. x plus 1 square equal 0, it means uh, 
x equal to o, x plus 1 equals 0, x equal minus x equal to o, x equal minus 1. So it is really good like this. So basically, uh, x minus 2. x minus 2 x plus 1 times x plus 1 equals 0 i write twice this one x minus 2 equals 0 o x plus 1 uh, equals 0 o x plus 1 equals 0 x equal to o x equal minus 1 no x equal minus 1 hence those are referred to root so x equal to o x equal minus 1 so the 2 minus 1 0 one other one is 2 0 uh, writing like this then we don't uh, destroy the quality of the quadratic equation uh, quadratic uh, cubic equation cubic equation should have uh, three roots so now uh, there are three roots. One is x equal to, and the other one is x equal minus one, and the other one is x equal minus one. But with the observation, we know that that is repeated root. And then uh, to find when x equal zero, where the curve crosses y-axis, we can find. Uh, when x equals 0, y equals 0 minus 2 times 0 plus 1 square which is minus 2. So it will go across the 0 uh, minus 2. The curve crosses y axis at uh, 0 minus 2. Then uh, what will happen to the what? what is the coefficient of cod cubic term it is positive so i'm expecting this kind of design it means uh, when x goes to positive infinity y also goes to positive infinity when x goes to negative infinity y also goes to negative infinity so, uh, y x and this is minus 1 0 this is 0 minus 2 this is the repeated root minus 1 0 and the other root uh, 2 0 now you can check uh, the previous uh, sum that is this is d you can check uh, c it is at c you can see that is 2 minus x uh, at d it is x minus 2 so you can see the difference that made Part a y equal x square x plus two to find roots y equal zero then uh, x square plus x plus two equal zero then x equal zero o x plus two equal zero x equal 0 o x equal minus 2 then uh, when x equal 0 y equal uh, 0 from the above one the points are 0 0 and uh, minus 2 0 now actually we don't need to look at x equal 0 because when x equal 
0 we know y equals 0 and coefficient of x cube is positive so we are expecting uh, this kind of graph um, then x goes to positive infinity y goes to positive x goes to negative infinity y also goes to negative so i'm expecting so zero is a repeated root and this is minus two zero and this is going to when x goes to negative infinity y also goes to negative infinity y also goes to negative infinity and this curve go along the along the vertex basically Question F to find roots make it y equals zero then x minus one square times x equals zero x minus uh, one square equals zero or x equals zero x minus one equals zero x equals zero x equal one no x equal zero now uh, x equal one is a reported root so the points are uh, zero zero and one zero now we need to don't need to check when x equals zero because we know what is y equals zero now let's check the general uh, rule the coefficient of x cube base uh, positive when you look at this one it mean i'm expecting this kind of graph uh, it mean x goes to positive infinity y also goes to positive x goes to negative infinity y also goes to negative infinity now you can see so far we are doing graphs uh, either this one this shape or either this shape that's all so far um, y x going 0 0 is a uh, root and 1 is a repeated root zero zero and this is one zero one zero question j um, what are the roots one zero one is repeat or root and uh, minus three zero and when x equals zero uh, x equals 0, y equal 3 and uh, the shape of the graph this way or this way um, when you look at minus x square 1 plus 2x plus x square when I explain this one this x square multiply with this uh, plus x here it's become uh, positive it's doing a positive value so I'm expecting uh, this kind of graph it mean uh, x goes to minus infinity y goes to minus infinity x goes to positive infinity y goes to positive infinity so this is the graph then we can do this is repeated root one is a repeated root graph go somewhere zero three y and x this is zero uh, one zero 
1, 0, and this is minus 3, 0, and this is 0, 3. So this is the graph. So now you, you don't need to, to work out now. When you look at, you can see the graphs. But we have to write uh, to find roots y equal 0, make y equal 0, 1 minus x square, 3 plus x equals 0, 1 minus x square equals 0, or 3 plus x equals 0, 1 minus x equals 0, or x equal minus 3, x equal 1, no, x equal minus 3. So minus uh, 3, 0, and 1, 0. Now, when uh, x equals 0, y equals 0, 1 minus 0 square, 3 plus 0, which is uh, 3. So that point is 0, 3. The curve cut y axis at uh, 0, 3. Now, since the value is positive, we know that x goes to uh, positive infinity, y goes to positive infinity, x goes to negative infinity, y goes to negative infinity. So, it's still the same graph I am going to draw, a bit larger, that's all basically. Um, this is 0, 3 and this is minus 3, 0 and this is uh, 1, 0. To find roots, uh, this is h. To find roots, we want to make y equal 0. So x minus 1 square, 3 minus x equal 0. x minus 1 equals 0 or 3 minus x equals 0, x equal 1 no, x equal 3. And uh, 1, 0 and 3, 0 are the roots. Uh, to find when x equal 0, y equal 0 minus 1, 3 minus 0, 1 times, 1 times 3, which is 3, so 0, that point is 0, 3. And you can see now, the coefficient of cubic term is gen a negative, in general, this is true, x goes to minus infinity, y also goes to minus, x goes to positive infinity, y also goes to, oh, okay, that's wrong. Uh, it is opposite actually, this kind of a graph. Uh, x goes to negative infinity, y goes to positive. And x goes to positive infinity, y goes to negative always operative, negative to positive, positive to negative. Um, X axis, Y axis. Uh, this is 0, 3. And um, this one is 3, 0, 1, 0, repeated root 1, 0, and the other one is 3, 0. That's all. You can check with the previous one. You can see that in that one, the, uh, it is uh, 3 plus x, and actually this is x minus 1. The similarities and differences. Question number 
to find roots make y equal 0 then x square minus 2 minus x equal 0 x equal 0 or x equal 2 so this is uh, 0 0 and 2 0 and I put a mark like this so this is going to be a repeated root and I don't need to find when x equals 0 because we know that and then I look at the um, coefficient of cubic uh, term that is going to be negative in that case I'm expecting uh, uh, this kind of graph So x goes to positive infinity, y goes to negative. x goes to negative infinity, y goes to positive infinity. Mm. Why? x 0 0 and this is going to be 2 0 to find roots y equals 0 x square minus x minus 2 equals 0 x equals 0 or x equal 2 so this is going to be a repeated root so 0 0 and 2 0 i don't need to check again when x equals 0 what is the y value because we get uh, x equals 0 as answer root and uh, when i check uh, x square coefficient of x cube is positive um, if you are not you can simplify and see x square times 3x cube this is 2x square see this is plus 3 is positive then I am expecting this kind of graph uh, x goes to positive infinity y goes to positive and x goes to negative infinity y goes to negative infinity um, Zero is a repeated root. Zero, zero, and this is two zero. 